Hey, what's up everyone? This is Hishin K playing Grand Theft Auto San Andreas Dime Edition. Today we're gonna play a mission made by Jimmy Light Park. And the title mission, it's uh, a few steps to the side, uh, which is the 48th mission. I mean, 41st mission of uh, his, uh, the Edge of the High Life series. So yeah, we don't waste fair time, we'll hide this mission and start playing this right now. Ten minutes later, at back at Nate's house. What the fuck happened? It was a meeting between Gary and Conrad. Can you believe that? You cannot be serious. I wish I wasn't. Did you hear what they are, were talking about? We couldn't get close enough, but they didn't talk much since Scott began at shooting. What? Shooting? How do you mean, shooting? While well, shooting, Gary and Conrad ran away in a matter of seconds. Fuck, I thought I made it clear when I said you mustn't have me seen. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Relax, it was dark. You couldn't see our face. There's no way you, you can be 100% sure. We made a deal yesterday that we were gonna lay low for a couple of days. All you did was draw more attention. Attention. We don't need, get it? I'm sorry, man. Ah, uh, bullshit. Go home. I'll call you when to meet, you meet me and lay low for fuck's sake. Oh, it seems that someone's getting mad, man. Next morning, in front of Scott and Thomas' house. Get in the car. Drive to Max, Mike's Hammond house. Oh, something tells me that uh, he's gonna he's gonna like uh, stop working for Nate and start working with a new guy, new guy that he just met like a few missions ago. Yeah, hi, my name's Geraldine calling from Casa City. This is such a great country. Why would you go anywhere else? It's unpatriotic to travel. I mean, I got war, famine, depression, and pollution right here on my doorstep. And parents, don't let kids go a rail after college. They'll come back with ludicrous misconceptions about healthcare, charity, and civilization. Oh Europe God. is not the real world. This is... Well, I love to slum about in the dirty youth hostel with communal showers as much as the next man. So. Who are you, sir? My name is Scott Blake. I'm here to see Mr. Hammond. Right this way. Sir, Mr. Blake is here to see you. Excellent. Leave us alone. Oh, he has some guards, alright. I'm glad you show up. I didn't come here to chat. I'm here because I want to talk about the job offer. Fair enough, Mr. Blake. Allow me to fill you in. I'm a businessman in from Last Venture as if for quite some time. I want to expand. To be exact, I want to expand Los Santo in surrounding area, of course. To accomplish that, certain adjustments need to be made around the city. And I assume the first adjustment was me and my team getting rid of Cesarea Clubbles? Correct, and now I want you to help me expand my business around Los Santos. In return, you will be rewarded appropriately. Ah, right. I guess we have a deal then. Great, I have a first job for you right now. There's a van that belongs to me at the parking lot under Mohelens intersection. I want you to go there, get it, and drive it to the address I give you now. Kill anyone who tries to stop you from getting the van. Don't wreck the van. Call me when you deliver the van to the assigned location. Good luck. Get in the car. Alright. I'm carrying pistol. Still carrying pistol. Alright, what's next? Pick up the van from the Mahal intersection. And as for destination point, it points me down, which means I have to go down from that hill. Can I go from here? Stop it's a little bit risky. It. Well, I'll, I'll take the risk. The to talk to me about a well, that's, that, that isn't a good a risk. Come on, come on. No on your wheels. Thank you. I mean, any I was teaching him how to swim. I have a lot of experience with this. Alright. Stop for a moment and let me read from my travel journal. 
I think everyone should keep the journal. Paste pictures. Oh, no, I have to go up there. Sometimes people oh, no, I'm taking the right uh, altitude right now. Pennies of their local currency and they will fall. Some people think this is patronizing, but I've been tired enough. They need the money and I need the Oh, company. well, it doesn't really Besides matter. I know that uh, it should be very far. What? I mean, I'm actually at the city. Oh. Time for me to head south again. I'm James Pedestin, and this has been the Time Traveler. Downtown Los Santos. This is WCTR, committed to bringing you shows like The Wild Traveler, the show that takes you around you know, like, the world uh, and abandons you at the airport. Highway intersections and all that. And all the other things that really matter to you. Like sensationalist bullshit. Call them an intersection. Show with serial killers and stalkers. Maybe I can go down Lonely from here. Is next. Through this sultry Man, come on, then are you wheels? What are you doing? Alright. I think this is the place I need to go. Yep, that's right. Oh, there's like. Okay, they are after me, alright. I'm gonna run over them. There you go, two dead. That's a good start, man. There you go, you're dead. Jenny? Uh, I don't think I really need pistol, but uh, why not? Just for fun. Drive the van to the location you know, Hammond gave you. Alright. No. I hope there's what no, like, uh, I wanna bring people enemies that try to chase after you with their cars or something like that. I'm just making sure by looking there. behind, of course. But so far, I don't see anything suspicious. You wonder why, or perhaps not. Brian from Las Venturas. Hey, uh, my name's Brian. I'm calling from Las Venturas. Don't want to talk about Let's see, is it from here? Just repeat back what you say and never it's listen. Are you brain dead, Brian? Oh, oh actually, it's ironic that you say that. It's no, it's not from here. Brain dead for it's years. not from here. Oh, so sorry. I seemed all insensitive for a second there, possibly ruining Okay, so let's go back. Can help if I slept with you? <laughs> yeah, I'm losing a few seconds from this mission. Well, there's no time limit, but you know, uh, if you want to, like, you know, finish this mission as quick as possible, I'm just saying that I'm losing a few seconds. Or in game minutes, in that case. Come on, go down. There you go. This is finish. Trrrring. The van is taken care of. Great, you just earned two thousand dollars, Mr. Blake. I wire the money to your account shortly. Talk to you soon about the next job. Hang up. Pick your car from the Mohanan intersection. I'll be back, guys. All right. I'm back. From where I got interrupted. So now I'm just going to head back to a Mohanan intersection. Damn, I just got crashed myself here. Okay, what is what is with this? Restaurants. I agree. It's such a good fake. Remember yeah. the Russians. Man, it's Thomas. Where are you? Mahalan. What are you doing there? I went to Hammond's house to talk about the job offer. And I accepted the deal. I really did a job for him just a couple minutes ago. Alright, well, I'm going to Ricky's place right now, so I'll see you when I see you. Alright, see you later, man. I'd like to meet her. On the conspiracy line, caller, you're in area fifty three. Unite. Hey, okay. Alright, cool. Animals can now be trained to fly. Yeah, I was wondering why, like, uh, while like there's like a phone call, I couldn't get out of the the vehicle. But uh, yeah, once the the calls are already end, I can get out of the car. But I still have to keep the car, like in one piece. Otherwise, I'll fail the mission. 
And yeah, I have to go up there uh, to the main character's house. Why can I go directly, you know, by crossing the hills and all that? I have to take the roads and in order to be able to have this vehicle go up there. Alright, almost there. Here's your checkpoint. Whoa. What the hell is going on? It seems that uh, something's crashing, man. I'll be right back, guys. Alright, time to play another mission made by Jamila part since that the last mission crashed but uh, it was pretty much uh, at the end. It's like it's, uh, only like missing like a de to be continued like uh, cutscene but that's pretty much it. And yeah, the title mission it's uh, Flashback which is the 42nd mission of his uh, The Edge of the High Life series. So yeah, we're always fair time with like this mission and start playing this right now. In the meantime, in front of Ricky's apartment building. You know, Thomas, I've been mean, meaning to ask you this for a couple of days now. What happened that day when you guys screwed up on a job and Scott got arrest? Ah, I thought you might ask me that at some point. Since you are in the team now, I guess it's alright for you to know what happened. Let's go inside. I'll tell you everything that happened in that day. Palomino Creek five years ago. They just opened in the bank, guys. All right. Does everything, everyone know that we're supposed to do? Yes. Let's go. So, go inside the bank. Oh wow! I'm playing as a character five years ago. All right. Cool. Bang! 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 Everyone, get your hands in the air. Shut up. Everything will be just fine. Don't you even think about touching the alarm, hot shots. Oh, he just did it. Start breaking into the safe. About two minutes later. Open it. Finally. <coughs> Cops are coming. How? Alarm didn't go off. Fuck, look at this. Silent alarm is off. Bitch, I told you not to touch the fucking alarm! Guys, the cops are coming! There's only one car. Oh, two cars. Oh, three cars. Fuck, we're gonna go back to the car. We'll go through the back door and around. You two hold them off. Come on! Shoot through the back door. Or I can just throw some punch. Alright, cool. Oh my god, oh my god. Make your way through the alleyway and kill the... Well, not kill, but just go to the other side. Are they enemies or what? Okay, yeah, they are. I was so confused, man. I thought it was like, you know, the cops uh, from the... You know, you know, the cops from the wanted levels. But there's no one in levels, so they're pretty much quick here. Hey, someone's shooting behind me, man, bastard. Oh shit, they fucking you wear, man. Am I supposed to save my allies or what? Oh shit. Yo, man, my allies didn't do anything, man. I'm taking damage, man. And there are like four of them not doing anything. Well, doing few things, actually. But anyways, let's go forward to the next checkpoint. Oh, they're waiting for me as well here. Alright, cool. At least I have a crate to protect myself here. Come on, come on, come on. Just die. You guys have no chance I get my MP5 firepower or whatever what's called here.
bang, 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 bang. I'm shot. Ah, uh, fuck. I'm not gonna make it. You gotta go. I'm not leaving you here, Scott. Come on, they're down there. Uh oh. It's Dwayne and Billy. It's your only chance. Go! Go or we both are going to prison. Over here! I'm injured. Don't kill me. We got one. The rest of them got away. And that was it. We get away with zero zero cash taken from the bank. That's the only job we went bad for us in so many years of being a take team. Not to mention that what big of sacrifice Scott made when he keeps his shot mouth shut and didn't rat us when the cops handed to him deals in prison. You know, he could have reduced his sentence for three years if he just said our names. He didn't want to rat us out, no matter what the cops promised to give him. He left everything he knew behind. For us, for that, I'm forever grateful to him. Wow, that's quite a history you guys got. I'm not sure if I can measure up to that. You proved yourself uh, on the last barrel job. You just, you'll do just fine. Thanks, man. Hey, you want to grab a beer or something? Sure. To be continued. Which means... That's pretty much the, the end of the mission. Thank you for watching and see you next time, guys.